Hey everyone, I just wanted to do a quick little video on how to achieve this look. But also, because right now, you guys are traveling and it's so much fun, so I wanted to tell you about my top 10 items that I put in my little makeup bag that are travel friendly and that you can achieve whatever freaking look your heart desires. So if you wanna learn more, like this video and watch it. So we're gonna get ready. First, we're gonna start with the face. Um, right now, my favorite thing to pack is the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. It's a nice uh, buildable coverage. So it's a medium to full foundation, to medium to full coverage foundation. And it gives you a natural look without looking cake face, cause we can't be about that line. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on my beauty blender. Just blend shiz out and I like it because a little bit does go a long way and you don't use a lot of product and it just really looks like skin it's freaking great looks natural but people don't know you're actually not using Too Faced to form this one okay so next is highlight or concealer, whatever. My favorite is the Tarte Shape Tape. Looks like this. And the Dofa applicator on it is freaking ginormous. Like, okay, big, yeah. And this is a very full coverage high, uh, concealer, but it does increase in the lines, in your fine lines. Which that's a freaking miracle right there. Like, okay, go try to find one that doesn't do that. Possible. But luckily I'm not holy. Luckily I'm nice and I already found that for you. So you're just gonna highlight under your eyes, your forehead, down the bridge of your nose, right here, and then right under your cheekbones. So you'll look like a warrior princess. But you're gonna be full glam. Okay. And then you just blend this out with your beauty blender as well. And what you do is you pat it in and then move, move it along your skin. And this prevents it from creasing and also it'll set on your skin better. Okay, next you would typically do like a dark color for your contour. But since we're packing and we got a you know space limit, we're just gonna do a nice bronzer. My favorite right now is this Ulta Baked Bronzer. And it kind of has a shimmery look to it. And this is very affordable. I just got it at Ulta, I think it's five or six bucks. So there's that. It's nice and it gives you like a summery glow, so it's perfect if you're on the beach. And this you're just you're just gonna put on your face all over the whole freaking face because you got you just have to especially if you know you're really pale it's a thing Voila. Um, my next favorite is blush and this is a little mini travel one and this is from Tarte it's their Amazonian clay brush and this is in the color sweet I just like it. It's so little. It's so cute. And it's just perfect for a little travel. And this also gives you kind of like a little shimmery look. You just dab it on your little cheeks. Oh, cute. So cute. Okay. Next, let's talk about the eyes. Um, right now, favorite palette in the land ever, ever is the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. It smells like peaches, it's freaking cute. Look at the colors, they're perfect. And I love it because it's got the darker colors, so you know, if you're going out at night, you can do a dark eye, or during the day, you can just have these nice neutrals, and they just match all your outfits. Like, can you really go wrong? No, no you can't. And then I like to apply it with this Morphe M441 brush. 
And this, if you're traveling and you don't have room to take your whole freaking brush collection, you could just take this one and your life would actually be fine. You would just be okay. And so I'm just gonna do a natural look because it's just, it's achievable. I'm taking this Georgia, okay, don't fall. Georgia, it's this light color. It's my transition. And I'm just applying it to the outer corner, or not the outer corner, fuck, the outer crease area. Yeah, yeah. And then next I'm gonna go in with this candy peach. I really like this color because it's just so bright and colorful. I actually just put this on the outer outer corner of my crease. The outer corner of my freaking eye. Yeah. I'm just dabbing it. And swiping it. Just whatever. Yep. And then next, just to finish this off, because we're gonna make it short and sweet to the point, um, my favorite highlight color is Nectar. This nice little peachy color. And just, you're just gonna get your finger. Yes, finger, you can travel with that. And just dab it on the inner corner, like this, like so. Yep. And you do the same on this one. And then you'll just apply, apply a little bit just to the top of your brow bone to accentuate it. Accentuate that feature. Beautiful. And the nice thing about this brush is it is stiff enough so you can like underline your little under eye, I guess. So I'm just gonna underline it with, what color is this? Summer Yum. I don't even know what that means, but I'm sure it's fun. Yeah. So I'm just gonna squeeze the brush like this. And I'm just gonna go under my eye. Like so. Doing eyeshadow under your eye makes your eyes appear bigger. Such a cool trick. Yep. It's freaking it. You're done. What up? Okay, so next we're gonna do a mascara. New favorite. OMG guys. This is from L'Oreal. This is the Voluminous Lash Paradise. If any of you guys have used the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, yeah, dupe, yep, half the price, what, yes. And it's the shiz. Changes the mascara game. That's what the little brushy looks like. You can see it. It's so cute. And yeah, you just put on your mascara like how you always put it on. I like it because not only does it volumize your lashes, but it also like separates them. Okay, and then this. The new thing is to have your brows on point. Yeah, okay. Well, if you don't have time for that life, the best thing ever is the Benefit Give Me, Give Me Brow. It's a tinted brow gel and it has fibers in it and so it actually fills in your brows at the same time. It's a freaking favorite. And it kind of smells like chocolate, which is cool, I guess, if you're about that way. So all you do is just, it's just a little brush and you just brush it on your brows. OMG, freaking cool. Okay, well last but not least, this is, you gotta set this, you gotta set it, or otherwise it's just gonna last 20 seconds. So this is the Laura Mercier uh, translucent powder, and this is great for setting. I just like it, it has a little puffer inside it that you can use also for, you know, kind of like setting your makeup throughout the day as it starts to wear off. I really like, this is the Morphe G2 brush. It's really compact, so you can just just bake your face. So I'm just pressing it in to set under my eye. Okay. 
and you're done. What? Yes. So these are the top 10 items that are the shiz for creating any look you want, but it's friendly for travel. Hope you guys like this. Let me know if you guys, have, oh, this is my makeup bag. It's got issues. So you guys have any suggestions for a good one? Let me know. Appreciate ya, bye.